Now, we may see more of these flash flood warnings in the days and weeks ahead, with the Highland Lakes already full and a forecast calling for a very wet May. KXAN investigator Kevin Clark is live out near Mansfield Dam. And Kevin, the Lower Colorado River Authority had to open those floodgates last fall, but of course they have no immediate plans to do so now. Yeah, we've actually have seen LCRA authorities come by through this area two or three times in the last hour or so, perhaps monitoring the conditions. But you can see the floodgates here at the Mansfield Dam. The LCRA says opening them depends on a variety of factors, where and when it rains and how much. Heavy rain from a few hours ago not only sets the stage for more runoff, but will likely cause the lakes to rise even more. Yesterday, we spoke with homeowners along Lake Travis who were concerned about just that. Tonight, we spoke with employees at Emerald Point Bar and Grill on Lake Travis who are preparing for a grand reopening tomorrow. They say so far, the rain and rising water levels haven't posed a problem, and they're optimistic it won't be a problem in the coming days and weeks. That said, employees tell me there was severe flooding into the restaurant back in October. It was flooding real bad. I actually don't live that far from here, and there was definitely streets that were blocked off you couldn't even go through. The levels of the Highland Lakes are continuously updated on our website under weather on KXAN.com. Kevin Clark, KXAN News.